Hello everyone, welcome to my channel. So in the first part I have shown how to make this flower. So now I will show you how to make the square in this flower. So let's make it. So first I will take a yarn. Then give a slip knot. Now insert the yarn in any chain space. So now I will start from the first corner. So first make four chain. One, two, three and four. This chain four count as one treble crochet. Then make more two treble crochet. One and two. So this is the first treble crochet stitch. So here I have got total three treble crochet then make two chain one and two so this chain two creates a corner then again make three treble crochet in same chain same chain space one two and three so this is the first corner then make one chain so now make the straight line make three trouble uh, three double crochet in next stitch one two and three make one chain make three double crochet in next chain space one two and three make one chain then again make three double crochet in next chain space one two and three then make one chain so this is the corner and this is a straight line so here i have used the treble crochet and double crochet so now make the second corner so first make three treble crochet one two and three make two chain make three treble crochet in same chain space one two and three so this is the second corner so make the straight line first make one chain 
then make three double crochet in next chain space one two and three make one chain make three double crochet in next chain space one two and three make one chain and make three double crochet in next chain space so this is the last to make three double crochet one two and three then make one chain so let me tell you how to make it so first make three travel crochet then make two chain then again make three travel crochet in same chain space then make one chain then make three double crochet one chain three double crochet one chain three double crochet one chain so continue the corner like this so there will be total four corners so here i have completed the fourth round now in the last make one chain and slip stitch in this fourth chain now work for last round so first make slip stitch in this next stitch make slip stitch in next stitch make slip stitch in this chain space <coughs> so make the corner again first make three chain then uh, this three chain count as one double crochet make two more double crochet in same chain space one and two so this so here i have got three, three double crochet then make two chain make three double crochet in same chain space one two and three so this is the first corner make one chain make three double crochet in next four chain spaces until you reached the second corner so make three double crochet one two and three make one chain make three double crochet in next chain space one two and three make one chain make three double crochet in next chain space one two and three make one chain and make three double crochet in next chain space one two and three make one chain so here i have got first corner then this is the straight line so here i have got total four double crochet each 
stitches so let's see how to make the corner so first make three double crochet in this previous corner so make three double crochet one two and three make two chain this chain to create the corner then make three double crochet again in same chain space one two and three so this is the second corner make one chain then make the straight lines so here is total one two three and four four spaces so we have to continue making three double crochet then one chain three double crochet one chain three double crochet one chain so continue making like this make three double crochet one two and three make one chain make three double crochet one two and three make one chain make three double crochet one two and three make one chain make three double crochet one two and three and make one chain so this is all the corners and straight lines so continue more two corners like the same way So here I have completed all the corners. So now in the last make one chain and slip stitch in this top of chain. So now give a knot and cut the extra yarn. So turn the work and insert hook in this back side and secure this yarn. Then cut all this extra yarn. secure this yarn also in the same process you can also use needle instead of crochet hook so it's easy for me to secure with this crochet hook so let's complete it then cut this extra yarn So this is the corner so you can use this square to make a bag or blanket or cardigan or anything you want so hope you will like it thanks for watching